Good day, language enthusiasts. Your daily dose of English wisdom is here at Snopey English. Ready, set, English. Today, we are going to learn beginner expressions about characters from fairy tales and stories. The first key expression is Barbara. What's your favorite fairy tale? This sentence is used to ask about someone's preferred fairy tale or story. The second key expression is I love Cinderella. It's such a magical story. This sentence is used to express a liking for a specific fairy tale, providing a brief reason. The third key expression is Have you read Little Red Riding Hood? This sentence is used to inquire if someone is familiar with a particular story. The fourth key expression is Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs is a classic. This sentence is used to acknowledge a well-known and timeless story. Barbara, what's your favorite fairy tale? I love Cinderella. It's such a magical story. I like Jack and the Beanstalk. It's adventurous. Have you read Little Red Riding Hood? Yes, the story with the wolf and the little girl. That's right. And what about Snow White? Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs is a classic. Do you know any stories about dragons? Yes, there's a story called The Reluctant Dragon. It's fun. I haven't read that one. Let's find it in the library. Listen to the following main sentences repeatedly and become familiar with them. Let's listen to the conversation between the two people. Barbara, what's your favorite fairy tale? Barbara, what's your favorite fairy tale? Listen again with subtitles. Barbara, what's your favorite fairy tale? Barbara, what's your favorite fairy tale? Listen carefully without subtitles. Barbara, what's your favorite fairy tale? Okay, let's listen to the next conversation. I love Cinderella. It's such a magical story. I love Cinderella. It's such a magical story. Listen again with subtitles. I love Cinderella. It's such a magical story. I love Cinderella. It's such a magical story. Listen carefully without subtitles. I love Cinderella. It's such a magical story. Okay, let's listen to the next conversation. Have you read Little Red Riding Hood? Have you read Little Red Riding Hood? Listen again with subtitles. Have you read Little Red Riding Hood? Have you read Little Red Riding Hood? Listen carefully without subtitles. Have you read Little Red Riding Hood? Okay, let's listen to the next conversation. Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs is a classic. Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs is a classic. Listen again with subtitles. Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs is a classic. Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs is a classic. Listen carefully without subtitles. Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs is a classic. We've looked at the key expressions so far. Let's remember the key sentences and listen to the entire dialogue repeatedly. Barbara, what's your favorite fairy tale? I love Cinderella. It's such a magical story. I like Jack and the Beanstalk. It's adventurous. Have you read Little Red Riding Hood? Yes, the story with the wolf and the little girl. 
That's right. And what about Snow White? Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs is a classic. Do you know any stories about dragons? Yes, there's a story called The Reluctant Dragon. It's fun. I haven't read that one. Let's find it in the library. Was today's study useful? Don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, and share. Goodbye everyone and see you next time.